What is the green powder you sprinkled at the end? Well, AA, I'm gonna answer your question today. A lot of you guys were asking about this green powder that I put on this delicious looking burger. If you haven't seen the video, go check it out on the channel, by the way, Smash Burger versus Royale with cheese. Anyways, the green powders, dill, chive, basil, whatever kind of green powder you wanna make, they're really simple and they're really flavorful. So take some herbs. Typically, I like to do this with herbs that are going bad. I'll take them off the stems and then I'll lay them out on my tray. This is a perforated tray, by the way, used in air fryers, just just like this Breville one right here. I stick it in the Breville dehydrator and then I set it to about 130 degrees Fahrenheit on dehydrate. Now you might be saying, what if I don't have a dehydrator? Well, cool. Stick it in your oven at the lowest setting, which this one is 170, then leave the door cracked like this, just like this here, and let it go till dehydrated, just like this right here you see. Little leaves that they look like they came from the sidewalk. That's what it should look like, all toasty, and they should look crunchy. You toss it into a blender, a high powered blender, just like this, and then you pulverize it until nice and smooth, like a powder, because that's what we're making. And I also like to run it through uh, some sort of strainer, just like this mesh one right here, just so it's extra smooth. And there we go. Basil powder, dill, chive, whatever. Put it on anything you want. These are so flavorful. You can even make a sauce with it. I always keep them in the freezer so they remain fresh. I've stored them for years. Drop some more comments so I could do some more voiceovers, by the way.